sweetie, these Lexus. <laughs> But you're showing me at Santa Pod. We're walking around looking at some of the cars. We're at the, like the car club section, I think it is. So actually my first time here. Uh, I did want to actually run on the drag strip with the RCF today, but I don't think I'm actually going to be able to do that anymore. But so far we seem to have walked past mostly hatches, which no, 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 no disrespect, but I uh, was hoping for something a little bit more exciting. Oh, hello. Hi, how's it going? Here we go. We're getting to the more exciting stuff over here. Hopefully there's a lot more. There's a lot of cars, as you can tell. a colour I was considering as well. That seems to be the majority of the nice cars here. Uh, there are quite a few others scattered around, hidden away, but for the most part, they're hatches, which is the thing with UK car culture in general or car shows in general. But hopefully, I'll find some others kind of hidden around because there's a lot actually like scattered in the masses, uh, hidden away. So, like here, for example, I would have missed these if I didn't walk back this way. There we go. Much more exciting. <laughs> so we're coming up to where the kind of access path and path is for the actual racing. I really, really, really wish that I could have gone on that. I'm still going to try. All right, so we're in the warmth of the car. Are you happy about that? Yes, it's yeah. much better. Uh, okay, so we actually managed to get signed on, which not not for the doll. Uh, to actually get on the track, it might take a, quite a few hours by the looks of the line, but. Um, I think we're, we're just about ready. Um, Meadow's not going to be coming with me, she's going to be coming on the outside. Yep. Bless her heart, in the cold. <laughs> it is absolutely freezing, I think. Next time I'm considering, if we do this again, I might make a club and then in, in, like, all subscribers that have a car, um, let me know if you're interested, then we can all go together. I think that's probably the best idea. And then we get to drive or park the car on not the wet grass and get stuck, as you saw. It was rather embarrassing. Anyway, I'm gonna go wash my tires and then hopefully get to go on. All right, so we're at the tire wash place, which is obviously something I really, really need right now, but uh, the fronts aren't doing too bad. I did have a little bit of fun and flick some of it off. Um, I am definitely gonna show you the drag run. I've got my helmet with the GoPro set up. Back wheels definitely need doing. Caked on, but it's kind of what I should have expected. Um, but I think it's, it's, it's pretty much telling me that I should be doing something all wheel drive very, very soon. I say very, very soon, prob probably very far off, as I've said, many, many years. My poor car. There's never been the filthy before, but it's okay. Um, they, they said they only wash the wheels, whatever, that's fine. I am ready. Surprisingly, no, like, no bumps or anything on the back of the car. I was worried there was going to be from being pushed, but easy. I'm so glad there was like a tow hook in there. It was so useful. All right, so we are now in line and we're next to the skyline. 
by the looks of it, which is quite interesting actually. Uh, I, I don't I don't know what type it is. I mean, other than it being an R33, I think it's an R33. <laughs> um, I don't know if it's rear wheel drive or all wheel drive. We'll find out. One, one thing I wanted to point out. So Meadow has has her hair. What, what do you use? Um, just a hair tie. You use a, a hair, hair bow. Tie. Hair tie. Well, I also have a hair tie because when I put my helmet on, it hurts. That's the, the reason I'm here. Still waiting. The car keeps constantly getting mixed up because people obviously want to put me with their friends and stuff. So, um... I don't exactly know what I'm going to end up against, but... Hopefully it's something similar to compare. I don't know. It's been about 20 minutes, uh, still waiting. Uh, I, I feel like I'm complaining about a lot of the cars here for the most part during this video, which I'm not trying to. Um, I, just, I was just hoping for a few more exciting cars. <laughs> He's not saying that there's not any exciting cars. No, no, because there's definitely exciting cars here like some really really nice cars but uh, for the most part not i'm hoping that we get again something as i said that's, that's kind of not equal but below me just so i don't look like i'm really bad and lose i'm not actually gonna like properly go for it because i'm scared i don't want to crash and die i already thought like earlier when it was getting pulled i heard something snap and it felt like it was inside the car and it was terrible it's like i felt like my whole front came off or something that's what it felt like look, look at the flyer look what's on the front all right GTR on a Ford Mustang. That's some of the cars I was expecting. I think I've seen one F-Type on here and that's about it. Okay? I'm nervous. You do great. Okay? Don't do any more than what you're comfortable with. Mm -hmm. Yeah, first time in this <laughs> as well, so. I'm gonna push it, but not like too hard. Yeah, fair enough. things off finally which is uh it's taken a long time i'm only going to use the one i'm only going to do one run today i do want to get home and get some of the stuff done mainly this video out yeah just open my window to diesel smoke brilliant now i'm gonna die of cancer <laughs> You're now supposed to do like a burnout if you want to. I'm not going to do it. He's definitely not, right? Surely. Sport mode, manual mode. No, he's gonna do it.
was spinning the whole way. Jesus. <laughs> oh, that was awful, but that was so much fun. <laughs> I feel like like oh, I'd, I've been sat for like three hours to get that run done and I feel like my wheels definitely, the tires definitely got cold but I'm okay with that. That was awesome. Was it worth a three hour wait? I don't know. Uh, I'd love to go again. I've got two more runs but you saw how long that was taking. I really, <laughs> I'm not keen on the idea of the wait. The rest of it's okay. Now I'm going to do a drive through of the actual event, I think, I think the exit is this way, I'm not too sure. I think everybody there is trying to leave. Okay. That was such a fantastic experience, I've now been waiting in the exit line for about an hour, probably more so uh, than an hour. but. It was so much fun to meet so many of you guys today. I'm definitely going to do more of these. As I said, I'm hopefully going to set up a club next time so you guys can actually take part in it, but I'll, I'll figure out the specifics at a later date. It will be in the summer because it was cold. Someone actually drove three hours here to come and give me some artwork. So I'm going to show it and I'm going to link his Instagram in the description because that's just... We don't know how to thank you. Um, but as I said, we're, we're waiting, not really moving. Meadow's actually gone to get some pizza because we're not moving at all. Didn't do a burnout because I have no idea, like I, I don't know how to do it in an automatic car. I know that you hold the brake and you feather the throttle or whatever, but I just, I didn't want to do it for the first time and mess it up. <laughs> but um, I, so I, I put my foot down, span for a while, a long while, like you heard it on the outside video, especially from Meadow's view. And then, um, I, I led off a little bit and then I kind of got in myself into, you know, properly, slowly on the throttle, doing the gearing properly, all that business. We're actually moving now. So I, I sent Meadow to get some food and now we're actually moving. I apologize. But as said, I would definitely, definitely, definitely do this again. But on a day where it's just the run what you brung, um, I'm pro that's what we'll probably do when we do the, the actual thing because I, this this is ridiculous. I'm not gonna get home for hours. I don't think I <laughs> Some of the cars here are insane Very nice indeed. And that would be about it for this video. Thank you my friends I mean it was so much fun to meet so many of you guys as I said that was probably the most fun I had of the days meeting everybody that I met. We arrived early and it took us two and a half hours to get in uh, and then we we're told that we can't actually go uh, to to the actual place we wanted to be, which was the, the actual strip. They said they're not. If we're not signed on, we can't go through. So I parked on the grass, and then I realised I walked up to the check-in desk, the sign-on desk, signed on, and they said, "Yeah, there's there's plenty. Like, come on." So I then walked back to my car, and th yeah, uh, that's that that's where the the trouble of getting stuck started. So by the time I got into the line, everybody was else was already lined up. I did one run. And then I was like, you know what? I've waited three hours in this line to get on once. I'm not going to wait again. I messed up badly. It wasn't that great at all, but the experience was fun. It, it was worth it. Cute to line up. It had been like two hours because people were getting stuck in mud and a BMW crashed outside. And it was an awful day, but a great day at the same time. I'm definitely going to do it again, as I said, on a dry day in the summer. And next time I'll actually warm my wheels up. So, and hopefully I won't have to wait as long. So my, my, my tires are not just sat there doing nothing for so long. Anyway, if you enjoyed and you want to see more like this, be sure to smash like. I definitely want to do more events and stuff like this in the future and meet you guys and announce that I'm going to do them. But uh, yeah, be sure to smash like, my friend. Subscribe if you are new and I'll see you in the next video. Until next time, peace.